Hello, everybody! Oops, so we're here. We are doing our Patreon tournament. Um, so we took your votes from last week, and we compiled the top four decks that you guys picked. Uh, we each picked one of our favorites that we wanted to play again, and a brand new one, and uh, composed this little tournament for you. So, the way this is going to work is today you're going to get this first quarterfinal, and then tomorrow will be this one, this one, this one, and then of course the two semifinal games and the finals like we normally do. I guess we can go over the decks that yeah. won. So do the that. two decks that uh, were voted for that I'm playing are The Elves Are Going to War and Norn and His Sisters. Hmm. And uh, for me, Giftstron and Mill. So the ones that we picked, I went with this Contaminated Frost list, which is really cool, and I don't think it really got a very good showing its first go around. And I think we have the wrong card showing here. So, zombies, and then this was Grixis looting, right? Which is the new deck. Which is the new deck. And I am playing this awesome Shadow Unlimited list that he, I think he submitted this to us like seven months ago or something like that. I've really been wanting to play it since. But uh, yeah, it is called Draconic Blinkburn. It's just a great name. Yeah. Plus, I mean, any excuse I have to play these lovely full art foils, Indeed. I'll take it. <laughs> So I think that's all the orders of business, other than deciding who goes first for this first game. So put these decks off to the side. All right, so to decide who goes first, we've got these two booster packs, Torment and Magic Origins. Uh, I don't really know what's in Torment all that much, but uh, I think a fair way maybe to do it, uh, convert a mana cost of the rare. Yes, so which pack would you like? We'd originally bought these when we did the unset because of the booster. Right, card. right, yeah. So they've just been sitting in the office for forever. So yeah, it's yeah. Probably time to just open them. I think so. Um, there could have been a foil Jason there the entire time. Uh, you're usually luckier than me, so you can have that one. <laughs> just in case there's a foil Jason there. Oh my. The highest converted mana cost rare goes first. Yes. I don't know where the rare is in this set. Probably Deep Anal! Sweet. <laughs> Basking Ruwala. Oh, wow! Three playable cards in a row. Wow, that's pretty impressive. Yeah. Liquify, Invigorating Falls. Uh, is this one of those sets that... Okay, good. There are actual symbols. So, you up to the rare? Yeah. Oh. One. <laughs> Five. Also a mythic. Also a mythic. <laughs> That's pretty sweet. And a Ooh! Forest. Look at that. Sweet. Well, we're gonna toss that foil forest in a deck and see you in game one. <laughs> Grim Lava Mancer. Pretty good. Oh, I didn't even realize. It's yeah, an actually good card. <laughs> That's a decent creature, honestly. What does it do? Everything. All right, game one. Go ahead. We've got... Those. And for me, this is what I'm working with. Boing. All right, let's rock and roll. Just a forest. Enter go. Just the forest. No turn one elf in the elf deck. Probably didn't need that, but I guess that's not terrible. Sacred Foundry untapped, going to 18. A slumbering dragon. Go ahead. Drop turn. A forest. And here is a Bramblewood Paragon. Ooh. Okay. Enter go. Untap. Draw a card. I suppose that's not the worst. This turn's just gonna be a Sacred Foundry tapped. Go ahead. Untip. Draw for turn. Think that is what we do instead. Forest. And an Elvish Arch Druid. <clears throat> which of course makes him a 3 3, but if I attack, that's a 4 4, so. Yeah. Not worth it. I mean, you can't block till it has five counters on it. Oh, right. You still can if you want. So I can still get it for three. Okay. So, counter. Fifteen. 
Yeah, and unlike the Tiny Dragons deck, I can't just, like, sprout this out of nowhere, or the Counters deck. I've used this card a lot, I just realized. Um, it's a fun card. Yeah. Anyway, good? Yes. Untap. Draw. Um, which one of these am I more scared of? So this one, Warriors enter yes. with a counter? Yeah, so other Warriors enter with a counter, and Warriors, or creatures with plus one, plus one counters on them, that I control. Yeah. Trample. Okay. Clifftop Retreat, which I have both. Three mana, let's Oblivion Ring Archdruid. Rude. I don't and know if I have an actual way to deal with the ring I don't think I do, but... And go ahead. Hmm. Draw off return. Hmm. I think we do this main phase. Collected company. Okay. Coco. Well, I got one hit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, it's a good one. Uh... Well, I didn't need more lands, and now there's four of them on the bottom. <laughs> I guess that's almost like drawing six cards. <laughs> and uh, we will attack you for three again. Counter, and ouch, 12. And it is your go. Untap. Draw. Maybe that'll come in handy. But for now, Sacred Foundry untapped, going to 10. Four mana, Thunderbreak Regent. Four, four. Pass turn. Untap. Drop for turn. Here is an Imperius Perfect, mm -hmm. which is a warrior, so she enters with a plus one, plus one counter. Yep. And has Trample now. And has Trample now. And pumps your other two guys. And, yes. <laughs> and pumps my other guys. So I think we go to combat. Yep. Four. Just that one? Yes. Um, He's a druid. He's not the combat one. Is Thunderbreak Regent actually doing anything for me? But you probably have like pump spells or something. I don't actually remember what's in this deck. I will... Ugh, I can't, though. Yeah, I'll block. So, before damage, four mana. Yep. For another collected company. Ah. I guess, yeah, you could hit some more lords. That wouldn't be great. Boom. Oh! Two more <laughs> lords. Okay, well, I'm actually glad I blocked then, I think. Yeah. Because then I'm just absolutely dead. Although, probably would be anyway. So, that's no longer for this world. Yes, and this one is Warrior. Okay. And it is your go. Don't know how I'm getting out of this one. Draw. I mean, that's not how. Uh, <laughs> oh, boy. That do anything for me. No, it doesn't. So I think I'm dead no matter what. Here's another Thunderbreak region. Go ahead. <laughs> oh, that's so many lords. So many yeah, the lords. The first selected company wasn't great, but that second one. Mm. Definitely made up for it. And I think, just to rub salt in the wound. Another lord? The <laughs> I mean, that's fine. Is, You're the one doing the combat, man. Who is a warrior. <laughs> and oh, come on, really? <laughs> go to combat. Yep. Swing. You're probably better off. Yeah. Yeah. Um, well, four counters on this bad boy pushes him over the edge. Oh, yeah. He's a big boy. And, uh, yeah, I'm definitely, I think, dead to all of this. So <laughs> let's uh, let's go ahead and use that forest walk. That's about the only thing. Yes. Yeah, we'll do that. So we can tap this for six mana. Uh -huh. Seven mana. 
We'll regenerate each of those, sure. and then we'll give all my creatures plus three, plus three, and trample. Yeah. So, what what, what is that total? You're going to have to do the uh, math now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so... This each one, each one of these lords is getting plus one, two, three, four, five, six. So eight there. Yeah. Same. Uh, no, this one's nine because it's not a lord, so it gets four effects. Oh yeah, right. Yeah. So seventeen. Uh, I don't think this is beating a giant thing, so we're not gonna worry about that because it's only getting plus six. So eight. Verse that doesn't get through, but eight here, verse four means four gets through, so we're at 21. Four, five, six, 21 six. damage, it looks like it's getting through. You got me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wasn't really getting anywhere with uh, any of those, but whew, that's a lot of lords. Yeah, so, the collective companies were very kind. You can have that, and we'll see you in game two. All right, game two. Show of hands. That is what I have. Good. And we've got... Those. Whoop. All right. Here is... Tap Sacred Foundry. Good. Rough return. Here's a forest. And a turn one play. Hey. Enter go. Untap. Draw. Here's a cliff top retreat. A dragon tempest. Good. Untap. Draw return. Forest. And the Imperious Perfect. Okay. Enter go. Untap. Mm. Yeah, I think that's probably it. Here's a Russian slumbering dragon. One damage to that. Pew. It's not dead. Not dead yet. But uh, red, bolt dead. Ah. Excellent way to clear the field. Yes. Um, and then... Generic Mesa. Go ahead. Untap. This gets haste Rock also. Return. Not that that matters. Very, sh very fine shrine Nykthos. Yep. Just for a colorless. And uh, an Elvish champion. Okay. Enter go. And a turn. 16. Go fetch out another Sacred Foundry. Oops. Alright. Untap. Draw a card. That was kind of the thing I was trying to avoid, but that's still, I guess, not the worst. Here's a mountain. Here's a Thunderbreak Regent. Two to that. Oh. And well, it, uh... Yeah. And it gains haste, because <laughs> it's dragon. Attack you for four. Oh, it's both? This right. creature yes. with flying under my control it gains haste if it's a dragon, it deals, it deals damage. damage. Yeah. So I had that a little Ow. backwards. But... 16. Good. Untap. Draw for turn. Well, that's just the best card I could have drawn. <laughs> if it was named Beast Within, it would have been. Here go. True. Um, draw a card. Well, attack you for four. Twelve. Here's a planes. Good. End of your turn. Collected company. Sure. Um, <laughs> reach death touch. I'm tapped out. Gary interlude. Flicker these two. 
Oh. Oh, that's... So wait. Oh, no, no, no. No, yeah, no, no, no. Step. Yeah, I'm you're on the end step, so I shouldn't do that. Oh, okay, okay. Well, I do have to do this, though. Because I can't let that regenerate. Yeah, I can't let that regenerate. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, at least you know I have that now. <laughs> Gotta do. Go ahead. I'm tapped. <laughs> yeah, right. That's not immediate. That's ghostly flicker. That's immediate. Well, just in case. All right. We'll play another one of those. And Paragon. So before your end step, <laughs> eerie interlude. Go to your end step. end step. Those come in. Pew pew. Um. He's the, he doesn't really do anything. <laughs> two two. True. Yeah. Pew pew. <laughs> And untap. Draw a card. Pretty good. What's... Okay, this game I actually drew some pretty decent stuff. Another Thunderbreak Raven. Ah, Boosh. Dead. Actually, could I have killed you? What do you have? 12? 12. So yeah, I can three. kill you. Three. Oh no, I'm one short. No, one short. short. One short. Okay, so kill that. Kill that. Eight. <laughs> Four. Go ahead. Untap. Draw for turn. Elvish Pomenade. Hey! I get a 1-1 one, one elf for all the elves I control. Sure go. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> Untap. Yeah, it's... He gets in there. Actually, he gets in there for some Mondo beats. Dragon Hatchling. Oh, I can't... Uh, four to this. <laughs> four to that. <laughs> <laughs> and this gets haste. It's not a May. Huh? Uh, it deals X damage to target creature or player. Or X is, oh, so it's not a May. Yeah. Um, so, eight... 9, 10, 11. Dead. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Oh, you had a war caller, too. Yeah, and uh, if you didn't kill this, mm -hmm. then I could have played that one, played him, and then he'd enter with two counters, which would then pump them. Oh, plus. God! Yeah, that that that, that interaction, because he's a warrior, yeah. is fun. Oh, God, that's disgusting. <laughs> but uh, you had an excellent this, way of... This is also pretty disgusting. <laughs> All right, so that was that, and we'll see you in game three. All right, game three. Go ahead. We've got... Those. And for me... I have this. And to start us off, Forest Elvish Mystic. Okay. Enter go. Start me off, Sacred Foundry untapped. In the region I was talking with Russian accent. Russian. Russian dragon. Good. I think. That's or is that Korean? Korean. No, that's Korean. the Korean one. Wrong accent. <laughs> <laughs> that was my Korean accent, too. Yeah. Uh... Yeah, I think that's what yeah, we'll right. play instead this turn. Uh-oh. Is the Imperius perfect? Okay. Enter go. Untap. Draw. Um. I think I have to. And it planes. Go ahead. Untap. Draw for turn. I feel like that's what we do instead. Oh so god, fast. again? <laughs> <laughs> I think that's just better, yeah. So it's your go. Oh. Alright. Yeah, when that's when that's what you top deck, you just Yeah. <laughs> oh god. Could be anything. That's really not good. Here's an English one. Go. <laughs> End of your turn. Yeah. Collected company. Yep. Come on, sleepyheads. Wake up, please. Imperius Perfect and Elvish Archdrake. Oh. Yep. 
Untap. Draw for turn. I mean, I guess it's only three, three, threes. Not the end of the world. So what is my mana at the moment? A bit? I got a bit. A bit. Got four with that. Bramblewood Paragon. Yep. And I think is was there a better way to do that? Because this would that, that would makes be four. Free, so that uh, oh, if I guess yeah, probably yeah, doing that. That makes one change. Yeah, that'll net so, you. So doing this nets me four. four mana. Yeah. So we'll use two of that for a Bramblewood Paragon. Okay. Two of that for a Bramblewood. Paracon. Mm -hmm. And that one is Warrior, so of course he enters with a counter. Sure does. And then we will go for five mana for a doubling season. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> and then we will Imperius Perfect. Yeah. Which will make two yep. Elf Warrior tokens mm -hmm. that each get four. Plus one, plus one counters. So you're gonna kill me in one hit, even triggering both these dragons. You just kill me in one hit. <laughs> okay. Uh, doubling season is just great. Okay. And uh, yeah, it is your go. Uh, that's, that doesn't do anything. I was sad when you killed the first one, and I had the doubling season in hand. The parry is perfect, but. I just got another one and a second copy of the Bramblewood Paragon Did you... to just make it dumb. Uh, one, two, yeah. Oh god. What do I do here? I really don't know what I can do here. Not Nothing with that, really. Yeah, the Imperius Perfect is still a 3 3 at the moment, so. If you have the Lightning Bolt. <laughs> Simeon Spirit Guide, two, oh. Oblivion Ring. <laughs> yeah, I guess the perfect because yeah, <laughs> just, doesn't just really make a difference. Ten power turn. Doesn't really make a difference. Go ahead. <laughs> well, I, well, actually, I guess it was making fourteen power a turn because there was yeah. two lords on the field too. <laughs> Untap. Oh God. Draw for turn. Oh my God. <laughs> You're not gonna like me. I already don't like you. <laughs> so, how is it that I miss a land drop and you get rewarded with 28 mana? <laughs> so the Nykthos makes one, two, three, four, five, six mana at the moment. Yes. So we will make six mana. We will use three of it for an Azuri. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, these uh, we'll, piddly little dragons aren't getting the job done. And then we'll use three of it and four of it for an elvish promen promenade, which I just drew. Okay. Making one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, so 14... Elf warriors. Elf warriors. Which are five fives. Which are all five fives. <laughs> okay. And... Can I just kill you this turn? Because <laughs> Elvish Archers I think makes... you probably can easily kill me this turn. Makes 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21 mana. So... So you can do that four times I with a regeneration? four times. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that does it. <laughs> Even though these are the only ones that can attack. Which actually gets under the dragon. Oh, it does! That's beautiful. So you don't even... I don't even get the block. <laughs> I don't even get the block. So attack and uh, overrun four times. All right. Uh, and I will regenerate one of these 14 L's. Okay. So <laughs> so that's an extra 12 plus... Yeah, you, you got me. That was a uh, beating. <laughs> good old doubling season.
I think the only way I win against this deck is if I land a yeah. If you land thing the before thing you before get I anything get lords, play. then yeah. I don't get a play. But <laughs> yeah, you stumble Oof. on mana and Oof. oh, Oof. that just well. Crazy. The thing is, even if I wouldn't have stumbled on mana, I didn't have anything that could have beat that. <laughs> yeah, that was. I could have played like, like a four drop. <laughs> like when you killed this first one, I was like, oh no, I'm gonna yeah. lose my my doubling season shenanigans. Oh with man, just one of these, and then I'm rewarded by collected company yeah. and dr- getting a second copy of this, and then drawing a second copy of that to just mm. make armies of five fives. My my one play set of lords couldn't keep up with your almost your entire deck as lords, <laughs> but uh, that is magic. So, that was this, and we will see you tomorrow for our second sem- quarterfinal match, which will be Mill against Zombies. Zombies. So, we'll see you there.